Hey everybody, it's the boss lady here coming to you with a Dollar Tree haul. Can y'all believe that? Now that's not to say I have not been shopping at Dollar Tree. I just haven't been hauling doing any videos. Well, anyway, boss lady back y'all with a vengeance. Um, and this is probably going to be one of two because I plan to go to another Dollar Tree just... Um, I want to get this one out the way and just so you know, you'll probably see another video of me in the same top I'm videoing uh, or recording the same day two different times of the day. But anyway, let's get to it. So um, I have been inspired by a few people um, and I'm not going to name names those who know who they are. They just know. Uh, but I have been inspired by a few folks uh, to do some DIYs. Um, some I will bring to the channel. Some I will not because you have already seen their video. But anyway, uh, let me show you the things I picked up. So something that's not all exciting is a door stopper. Um, I need a new one of these for my kitchen door. Um, I have a door that separates the kitchen from the dining room. And I typically use that door when it's hot. And I have the air on, and so I try to keep all the cool air on this side of the house and keep the hot air in the kitchen. Because I normally, when um, I'm cooking a lot, especially in the summer, I open up my windows even though I have the air on. So anyway, got this so I can uh, keep my door open when I need to be open. I picked up, and now people have hauled these like crazy. i just now picking these up. But I picked up actually two of the um, toolboxes. I had seen a DIY and she knows who she is. <laughs> but I picked up two of these uh, for myself to use um, for some personal things. And so I picked up two. Um, not sure if I'm going to decorate the outside. I really don't care if the outside is decorated or not. I just needed um, some type of kit to put some things away. So I got two of those. Then... Uh, I went to the, I guess you would say flower section, floral section, whatever, and I saw these beautiful little galvanized buckets, uh, for planting, so I'm going to do some flower arrangements in these, um, I'm thinking more or less for the kitchen, even though my kitchen is normally orange, I do like the sunflowers and the daisies and things like that, so I got two of these to possibly go in the kitchen, maybe on the porch, not sure, you just have to hang tight and see that later. Um, I was looking for some, like, floral foam, floral foam to go inside, you know, so that I can make my arrangements. And the styrofoam ones that they had were just too long and I didn't feel like doing all that cutting. So I picked up a pack of these. It's four in a pack. Looks like this. And just to stick down in the middle so that I can make my arrangements. Now, for those who have been with me a long time, you know I have a lot of flowers from um, Michael's that I had got last year with the uh, $2 boxes. And so I have them all in a box and ready to be, you know, decorated with. So I'm going to use some of those. Plus, I have some other flowers arrangements that I want to redo and whatever. So, yeah, going to do that. So I picked up actually two packs of these little green things um, to make my little flower arrangements. So I picked that up. And I'll probably do a video when I, you know, go to work on these. I won't be starting on those just yet. I'm waiting for the temperature to change. Um, we're having nice weather today, but still. I picked up a nail clipper, and it comes with two emery boards. I only need the clippers, but you never can have too many emery boards. I picked this up for Miss Peanut because she misplaced her clippers, and um, now she's old enough to clip her own nails, so she's old enough to have her own clippers. Pick that up. Um, I picked up, and I think I picked up two of these. Maybe, maybe not. Mm. I don't know. Anyway, picked up some fix-all adhesive. Uh, I have some, but I'm not sure exactly how much I have. So I picked up just a brand new tube just in case. Like I said, I'm in a DIY mode. And y'all know, Boss Lady don't do DIYs, right? <laughs> anyway, picked up some utility knives. And I got yellow. Um, at this particular Dollar Tree, they had yellow, they had black, and they had blue. And so, um, I would have rather to have pink. Um, I didn't want black because black just seems so manly. And, uh, so I got yellow because I thought this was bright. And at least if I see a yellow, you know, utility knife sitting around, then I know, hey, this is what I, you know, need to keep up with. 
Um, I picked up, and I think the lady must have separated everything out. I guess so. Anyway, uh, while Miss Pina and I were on our girls trip adventure, um, we really enjoyed our tea party. And now, one thing I have never done with Miss Pina from birth to now is actually do a tea party at home. Well, because we enjoyed what we um, had encountered this year and last year, we decided we're going to have our own type of tea party. Just her and I, just, you know, hanging out. Something that we can do, you know, on a Saturday or even a Sunday afternoon, um, you know, when daddy's busy, blah, blah, blah. So, we picked up some cute little plates, and I let her choose everything. So, she chose these plates, and sorry for the glare of the, the light here, but we got these with the matching napkins. And then, we picked out some pink cutlery, because like I said, it's a tea party. It's for her and I. It's not for, you know, just daddy. So, <laughs> we picked that up. And then we also picked up these spring fling cups for, I don't know if we're going to use it for fruit or whatever, but we're going to do something, some fun and special, just her and I here at the house, um, you know, in the next future here, something, whatever. Um, I also picked up this, it says Excelsior, not sure, but like some type of grass or whatever for my flower arrangements that I'm going to be making. Um, I had needed a new, uh, tablecloth for the kitchen, um, breakfast station area. I need a new one. And I can't remember if I told you guys, but I normally buy these and I cut them in half because they're so long and so wide that I don't need the full, um, extent of it. So I cut in half. So then I have two as opposed to one. So two for the price of one. Pick that up. Then, um, I saw these cute little fashion nail files with case and their emojis so i picked up one for myself and one for miss peanut so i can have it for my purse and you know put it with my nail stuff um something that i saw new at my dollar tree now this could be old to some people but it's new to me um i found some palmer's coconut oil formula body lotion so it looks like this and i got two of these and then I picked up one of the cocoa butter for Miss Peanut. And they're just like, you know, a little travel size or a small size to go inside your purse. So I picked those up. And then I picked up a bag of rocks for a DIY I will be working on. Um, then just as we were leaving, we saw some hand sanitizers with the emoji uh, cases. So these were the only three that we saw. So this one here, and this is cotton candy. This one is cupcake. And then this one, vanilla, very vanilla. So I thought these were cute. You know, we like to have these at all times. Um, and then my last bag is more or less cleaning supplies. Oh, and here's my other adhesive. So I did get two of these. Um, this was something new in my Dollar Tree. I had never seen this before. Um, it's Foaming Super Oxygen Bathroom Cleaner. Sprays on blue and turns white when clean. So, um, you know, I always say I'm in an old home. So, I like to, you know, have me some good stuff to do some scrubbing. So, I ended up picking up uh, two of these. And I normally get the, the scrubbing stuff that's in the green cap. But... I want to try this one, so we'll see how that works. I also picked up another bottle of the cleaning vinegar. I'm loving using this in the bathroom, especially like inside the toilet. Uh, we have hard water, so you know, we get like hard water stains or whatever, and so that works very well. And then the last thing I picked up was just my staple, which is the palm olive dish soap. And that is it, and that is all. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see everybody in a new video. Bye-bye.